Alright, what's going on guys? Welcome back to some more Pokemon Y Extreme Randomizer Nuzlocke. Last time we made our way here to Route 14, got a crazy legendary encounter. If you missed that episode, make sure you go check it. We also lost a very important and prominent Pokemon on the team. So, last episode is not one that you want to miss, but today we are making our way through Route 14 and making our way to Laver City. I'm pretty sure it's called Next Gym Town, but either way, if you guys are excited for this episode and do want to support it, make sure you drop a like. Your support is greatly appreciated. It takes one simple click and really, really does help out the episode. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel already, make sure you go ahead and do that. Just come on, you can unsubscribe at any time you want, so you might as well just click that button and do it right now. And you know what? Like, what, what do you got to lose? But this route is very annoying, and the reason for that is literally just because it's a swamp route. It is so hard to just even walk. Like, it, without getting a Pokemon, like, aside, it's just annoying getting through this route. And imagine if we got Kingdra. Like, I'm not for, I'm not gonna say at all that I would rather have a Kingdra than a Celebi, but Kingdra would have been very, very solid as an encounter. All right, so we made it to the scary, the spooky haunted house or whatever this is. I remember the first time I ever played X and Y and I got to this part in the game. I was actually creeped out, man. Like, you go in and they tell you this ghost story. We're about to see it, but I remember the very first time I ever saw it, I was like, What's about to happen? I thought I was about to get like jump scared or something and they're kind of like is a mini one right where it zooms in on his face But this part of the game is creepy as hell. It was a dark and stormy night many years ago Lost I arrived at this house and went inside the lights would not turn on so I fearfully looked around the house Eventually, I made my way into the kitchen. There was no sign of anyone being there the whole house is like one room I feel like the whole thing is like like, it's not really the kitchen. It's just kind of like the area where kitchen supplies is. I tried to tell him that I was lost, and I was hoping he'd let me stay until morning. But when I approached him, the man suddenly screamed, Stay back! Wait, what happens if I just press... If I don't press anything, does it just keep zooming in? What? What is it zooming in on? I apologized and continued to plead my case. Please, can't you help me? I'm not talking to you, he shouted. I looked at the man in surprise, and when I did this, the man asked, Can't you see them? Behind you, a horde of faceless men! Ooh. Now then, since I told you that story, will you please tip me? <laughs> I remember there was a rumor in the beginning of the game, the more times you tip people, it increases your shiny odds, but... That is not true, I'm keeping my money, fuck! That wasn't even that good of a story. That wasn't even that good of a story. Let's be completely honest. All right, so now that that's done, I'm pretty sure we just go to Laver City. People usually tell scary stories by the campfire, right? I've had enough of dark places and scary things. I'd rather rehearse my dances. I'll see you all later. Peace, bro. Tierno's just, he's not about it, man. He's not about the action. All right, well, I think LaVert is right here, and I said last time that I'm pretty sure you can get an encounter here, and it's not in grass, it's a surfing or fishing encounter, so hopefully that was actually true and I didn't just lie, because I would love to get an encounter. Oh, first, 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 this is something I always forget to do. Randomized mar- Latiosite, all right, fist plate, hardstone, you know, I might as well take the plate and the stone. Like, I don't know, might as well, but the Latios, I imagine if it was like a Soul Dew. If we found a Soul Dew, I think that would probably be, be better than Mega Evolving. What do you guys think? I don't know. Can I even surf here? You can't, no! No! Oh, thank God, okay, thank God. I was gonna say, if we really can't get an encounter, that is so unfortunate. Come on, buddy, let's go. What we got? We're reeling in the fish. Ooh, okay, a little float soul. I thought that was a Larvitar for a second. Like, just a really big Larvitar, but I will definitely take a float soul. All right, uh, let's Thunder Wave it first things first with Rudolph, and then I guess we just start chucking balls. It's only level 18, so it's not really like we can, you know, wait. Don't be electric type. <laughs> of course it is. Why would it not be? Why would it not be electric type? All right, I have four great balls. I never got more after Celebi. Oh no. It's got Flash Cannon. Hold on, this would be a great Pokemon to have in the back. It's got Stab with special moves. Oh, I don't think there's anything I can do to like get it lower now. I think I just have to throw Great Balls. Oh no, unless I do exactly what I did with Celebi and I U-turn it with a slow starting. That's actually not gonna kill, it's resisted. There's no way this kills. If Celebi can live this with it being super effective, I don't think there's any way it's gonna kill a Float Soul, right? Right, and if it does, I'm sorry, but come on. Come on, there's no way this kills right here. Thank you. 
Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. Why did I click A? <laughs> I meant to swap out back to sweet. All right, well, we're just gonna forget about that. Let's just pretend nothing happened. Yo, that was definitely not embarrassing at all. That was definitely not a super strat, right? That wasn't worst top 10 super Nuzlocke moments ever, right? Wasn't it? Anyways, all right. Thank God it was just a float soul. If it was anything better, I'd, I'd probably be crying right now. But let's grab this Pokeball and then make our way up to the Pokeball factory. Speaking of balls, all right. Speaking of balls. And actually, do we take on the gym now or after? That is something I don't know. Because if we do it now, then never mind. Let's go take on the gym. Never mind. Let's go take on the gym. I'm ready. Fuck yeah. Of course I'm ready. Laver City Gym. I don't know the puzzle at all. I'm going to be honest. I... I have no idea how to get there. So there's gonna be a lot of random moving until we hopefully get lucky. 48? Uh, maybe I'm not ready. 48, what the f Focus set. freeze dry? Oh my God. <laughs> Dude, that was a roller coaster. That was an actual roller coaster of emotions. I need to level up. I mean, I'm obviously, I'm just gonna use rare candies, whatever, <laughs> but, oh, the honey. Imagine if it was like another ability capsule or rare candy. I was talking about rare candies. Imagine if that happened again. I would have lost it. I would have actually lost it. Uh, but I, I think I need to do some leveling up. All right, so I decided on a level cap of 44, just so it kind of gets us halfway there to the 48, but still not over leveled. I remember what everyone wants. Everyone wants me to lose Pokemon, okay? I get it. We're gonna try to lose some Pokemon. Wink, not really. Oh my God, a Blaziken. Oh! Yo, did we see the Torchic last episode? That looks sick. That is so sick. Oh, yo, that makes me want to see, like, Sceptile and Swamper, because if Blaziken has a texture, I bet they do, too. Boat, you absolute tank! Oh, my God, dude. If I didn't do those levels, Boat would be dead right now. Holy crap. One more time. <laughs> Come on! Is he a Vespaquin? There we go. All right. I think one more Pokemon, right? Hoopa. Perfect. At least it's just this one. Um, I'm just gonna Shadow Claw, of course. And it doesn't even matter because he killed himself. Cool. Well, that's one way to do it. <laughs> that's one way to kill a Hoopa. And I'm pretty sure I'm at the end right now. I think I just go right here and then there's one more. Oh, and she's got a Celebi now. Perfect. All right, well, at least we know what type it is. It's dark type. Let me heal. Let me heal, please. Dark pull. Ooh. Oh, we get Dark Pulse coming? Okay, that is actually clean. Maybe Celebi should come on the team, who knows? Either way, I'm getting out of here. If he's going for Dark Pulse, I'm sending in... I really don't know. I think I'm just gonna go Big Head here and just try to Roar of Time it. I, I don't know if there's any other, like, better idea. Maybe Techno Blast. Let's try that first. Pretty solid. All right, but with that out of the way, I'm pretty sure, yep. Valerie, there we go. So we made it to the gym leader. That actually took me a long time. I'm not even gonna lie. That took me a while to get here. Let's heal up real quick. Might as well just lead off with Lapras. It doesn't really matter. And let's go ahead and see if we can get our next gym badge. And of course, after this, we got the Pokeball Factory. So it's just, it's a roller coaster. I know I say that a lot, but it really is, man. Oh, if it isn't a young trainer. So you've flown all the way through my gym, fluttering down to me at a fortunate win. And I suppose you have earned yourself the right to a battle. I'm Valerie, who leads this fairy gym. I hope you visit, uh, I hope this visit will prove I'm entertaining to you. The elusive fairy types may appear frail as a breeze and delicate as a bloom, but they are strong. Delicate as a bloom. All right, Valerie. Let's see what you got. Let's see. She always kind of creeped me out, man. It's just her eyes, like, it's just not like scary, but it's just like, damn, like, it's kind of, kind of creepy. All right, six Pokemon. We can do this. I know we can. 45. Let's just, let's just Seed Bomb. Let's just Seed Bomb and see how much it does. Eh. Uh. Okay, we ate that. I was going to say, I'm just a little scared, but. All right, cool. Spritzy goes down. There's one down. What's next? What's. Ooh. 
Not that I'm like scared of this Pokemon, it's just what am I gonna kill it with? Who knows? The Steelix, I mean, on the, on the offensive, it's really not too threatening. It's, you know, not the strongest Pokemon in the world, so. It's just Shadow Claw off rip. He's level 50. Oh my God, never mind. I got this whole leveling thing off. Shadow Claw does nothing. Perfect. I'm staying in just so we can take the Rocky Helmet. I don't know. Who else do I switch in to take an Outrage? Oh my God. I thought that was a crit. What the? F All right. I'm getting out of here. Outrage. Do I go to Pork? I think I have Pork eat this up. Let's try that. Pork. Come on. Come on. This is breakfast for you, right? This is breakfast food. Oh. Maybe I should have just healed on Frisbee. I really should have just healed. Oh, this is not good. This is not good, guys. Hit yourself. I need him to hit himself so bad. Just so that way I can attack. And he doesn't. All right. I, I think I just have to get him to hit himself. I really don't know. I mean, if Lapras can take one, then I guess I could swap to Lapras, but... He's probably just gonna heal on this turn, right? What if I Seed Flare? Damn it. What if this is like times four randomly? He could be a Dragon type. I should have just Aurora Beamed. Oh, I should have Aurora Beamed. I really should have. Yeah, because he's probably Dragon. He's probably Dragon type. At least the special defense dropped. So if we can get this Aurora Beam off, he might actually be dead. You might be dead right now. Let's go, Suicune! Picking up the first kill, I think. That's Suicune's first kill, right? Because it definitely didn't kill Celebi. It helped us catch it. All right, cool. Let's get his act together. All right, no more slow start. Thank God. If I swap out and come back in, is there slow start? Either way, there's a Volcanion come out. We, we got way bigger fish to fry right now. Let me go to Big Head. And let's just see if our Big Head can be... Our, our mind can be bigger than this Volcanion. Come on. Oh my god, it does nothing. I mean, I always forget that this Pokemon's actually hella bo Moody! All right, at least the special defense dropped. So that way we can get a bigger hit with this Techno Blast here, but oh my god. Come on. That's perfect, is that- Ah! Oh! So close, dude. The Moody's just scaring the shit out of me. Like his evasiveness is raising. Oh no. Oh no, and it missed. Oh my God, special attack just. <sighs> Guys, this is not good. This is not good. Technoblast, please hit, dude, just please hit. No more PP. Oh my fucking God. This is not good. <sighs> Bro. His accuracy keeps raising. He's not going to miss Zap Cannon. How do I get out of this situation? We just need to hit our moves, bro. Accuracy ro Yeah, he's never going to miss. He's never... Evasiveness fell. All right, Rudolph. I might need to sack Rudolph here. I might need to. Oh my god! Defense rose, evasiveness fell. I think I need to sack Sawsbuck here. So I can heal like Frisbee or something. Who eats? Well, actually, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I might not even have to do that. Boat, you're a, you're a ground type, right? I think I just do this. Because he's got Zap Cannon, Spite, Thunder, and one other move we haven't seen. So as long as it doesn't affect me, we might be all right. All I need to do is hit one drill run, I'm pretty sure. He swapped! Oh, that's amazing. Oh, that's so good. So good. Dude, that was getting terrifying! That's why Moody's banned, bro. That is literally why Moody is banned as an ability. Volt switch, let's get out of here. Let's just hop out of here and what do we bring in? Lucky. Let's bring in Lucky so we can Mega Evolve. This gives me a free Mega real quick. That's super effective. 
I'm going for D-Pulse. I'm going for D-Pulse. It's not going to be super effective after we Mega, so not really scared. All right, come on. Come on, baby. This is for big money right here. If we somehow don't kill, I'm going to be a little scared, but I think this... Come on. It's a Grottle at half health. Thank you. I would have been really concerned if that didn't kill. Like, actually concerned. Boat level 45, that's what I'm talking about. Sinchino's coming out next. Should I just run it? Should I just stay out? He's 46, holding the air balloon. Okay, that's nifty. I see you. Shark, ooh. I don't like that. I do not like that. Catch this dragon pulse. Hold this dragon pulse, and you're faster. Damn. Air balloon popped. Bone run. Oh my god, thank. Oh, let's all just pray. Or not pray. Let's all just say thank you that it did not have skill link. Oh my god, I need to walk around after that. Of course. Oh. I was literally thinking to myself, what if it has like a linking move, but then, you know, obviously it doesn't have skill link, but. <laughs> That would have been terrible. All right, let me heal up here. Because if I can finish this with Lucky, I might as well try. Um, let's see. Deep pulse. Super effective. A little dragon type mill tank. All right. Here's the Volcanion. What do you... Let me see if I can just do it like this. Let me see if I can do it like this. Spatial rend. Come on, that's got to do a load of damage, bro. Load of damage. That's a lot. That is even more than I thought it would. And do I have any space? Come on, did he just take my spatial runs away? Defense Rose. Okay, good. Not evasiveness. Amazing. I don't have spatial runs. Are you serious? All right, D Pulse better kill. Come on, I need this Volcanion gone, bro. Thank you. Oh my god, that was so annoying. Oh, Moody is terrifying, bro. Anytime you see it, it's just like, holy shit. All right, I hope the sun is shining tomorrow. That would be enough for me to smile. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was a fine battle. I should reward you with the fairy badge. Isn't it captivating? Oh, so captivating. That's exactly what I was thinking. Just look how captivating this badge is. <sighs> Valerie, I sincerely hope that both sides of your pillow are warm. Oh, I hope you miss the ice cream truck every time you go outside. I hope that whenever you're at home and you, let's say you get like takeout pizza and you put it in the refrigerator, like are these gonna be my leftovers for tomorrow? I hope your roommate eats it. I hope your roommate eats your fucking leftovers. Splash, splash. That's the best you could give me. We're going to the Pokeball factory. Oh yeah, you're going to the Pokeball factory. I got some bigger fish to fry. Splash. That's just, that's embarrassing. That is, <laughs> that's a diss, honestly. All right, can you even get an encounter over here yet? Oh, please tell me. Hey, stop right there. You wanna go beyond this point? You'll have to join Team Flare. Hey, honestly, why not? <laughs> why not? Let's go ahead and do it. All right, Pokeball Factory is right up here. Let's go check it out. Oh, wait, hold on, you get a little Dust Stone action real quick. Let's get it. Or Gengar Ride, excuse me. I think you get a Dust Stone still in this town, but I don't know. I just knew this trainer gave you something. Okay, let's get up to this factory. I wish there was an encounter here or something, man. That would be amazing. How we doing, Shauna? He'll let us in. You'll see. I'll go talk to him again. Doesn't she just, like, break in? Oh, no, she comes running now. <laughs> I totally forgot how it works. All right, what's up, guys? What's the deal? We're supposed to meet here. I wonder what the matter is. Eek! And then they come sprinting. Shot of wait! Stop! <laughs> what a guy. What a lad Trevor is. All right, well, yeah, it does look like it's time to go in and take on the Pokeball Factory, but we're gonna be doing that next episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, make sure you drop a like. Your support is greatly appreciated, and I will catch you guys then. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Bye bye